Welcome to my gourmet kitchen. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make honey garlic chicken wings. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. The ingredients for this honey garlic chicken wings will be down in the description box so you guys can just go there and check it out. Jave Beats exclusive. that I'm using to make that lovely honey garlic chicken wings. I'm using one teaspoon of paprika, one teaspoon of onion powder. I'm just using half teaspoon of chili flakes. I got one teaspoon of chicken season, one teaspoon of black pepper, one teaspoon of all purpose, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of dry thyme. And here I got one cup of soya sauce that I'm using. I'm using one cup of all-purpose flour. I got some chopped garlic, about seven clove. And here I got my honey that I'm also using. And in here now I got about 18 pieces of chicken wings that I'm also using. Now guys, I'm gonna start off by cutting my wings into two, right in the joint here. But yes guys, I've already washed my wings with vinegar and lime. So they are properly cleaned up guys. So. I'm just going to cut them into two now. So I'm going to cut them right down into the joint here. Just like that guys, into two. I'm just going to show you guys. So that's just like that. This is the last one of my chicken wings that I've cut into. As you can see, I got the wing bit and also the stump bit. Yes, guys, I just cut them into two. Just like that, guys. I'm gonna cut them up into two pieces right in the joint there. Now, let me put away my cutting board. Guys, outside. Now, I'm gonna start to season up my chicken wings purpose chicken seasoning sorry that was my paprika my chicken seasoning now my all purpose my garlic powder also my onion powder chili flakes guys this is optional because I like it a bit spicy that's why I'm using some chili flakes on it so guys, you don't have to use the chili flakes and I'm just gonna give this a right now guys all of those seasoning to my meat I'm gonna make sure you rub them in properly guys all of that seasoning that you just put on the chicken wings guys because Make sure your chicken wings are seasoned properly, guys. You want to make them taste juicy when you're eating them, guys. So just rub in all of that chicken, all of that seasoning on your chicken wings. Make sure you have a gloves when you're doing this, guys. So you know, it's up to you. If you don't want to use your gloves and you want to just use your, your bare hand and rub in your meat, it's up to you, guys. But I'd rather to use the gloves. This honey garlic chicken wings gonna taste lovely, guys. I tell you, I have it before, and I'm telling you, it was so amazing. The season smells so nice there on my wings. Have 
it guys. I'm just gonna cover this up now with my cling film and leave it for an hour to marinate. Make sure all of those lovely powdered seasoning soaking onto my meat. Yes guys, I'm just gonna leave it for an hour. But before I'm just gonna rinse off my hand. up now with my cling cling I'll get right back to you guys when my chicken wings are finished marinating guys and now when my wings are marinating I'm just gonna put them to the side I'm just gonna get a base now now guys I'm just gonna season up my flour with some powder seasoning I'm gonna throw it, throw it into this basin. Yes, guys, this is what I'm gonna dip my wings in to coat them in before I start to fry them up. Yes, guys, I'm just gonna use a tablespoon of all purpose, a tablespoon of paprika. Sorry, just like that. A tablespoon of black pepper. Tablespoon of all purpose. Now so I'll be using a tablespoon of salt. I'm just gonna get a fork. A fork and mix that around now, guys. Mix all of those powder seasoning into your flour. Properly, guys. Just like that. This is what you're gonna remember, as I said, this is where you're gonna dip your wings in. Before you put them into your oil to fry them up. So you want to season up your flour that you're going to use to dip your wings in it. Now guys, after that hour, my chicken wings are finished marinating. But before I remove my cling flame and add them into my flour, coat them into my flour guys. As you can see, I got, I'll be using my deep fryer, yes guys, to fry them up. If you don't have a deep fryer guys, you can always use your pot, a small pot like this. Yes guys, with about six to seven cups of oil into it just preheat it on your stove for about five minutes yes guys I and mean, then after that when it is preheated with your oil you can go ahead and just coat your chicken wings and add them into your pot for about 10 minutes fry them for about 10 minutes guys and then you have the same thing that i'm going to be doing here yes guys but now i'm just going to go ahead and just put this tray add my oil into my deep fryer yes guys I'll get right back to you guys when my oil is added finish adding my oil into my deep fryer guys as you can see now I'm just gonna leave this to preheat about five minutes before I start to add my wings in yes guys but in the meanwhile it's preheating I'm just gonna remove my from my chicken wings now guys after that five minutes as you can see my oil is hot in my deep fryer let's put this over here now i'm just going to go ahead and start to add my wings into my flour coat them into that flour guys properly Excess flour, add them to that tray. So like that goes. Take off the excess flour, add them to the tray. Now 
remember guys you're gonna leave them in there for 10 minutes if you want you can just get a timer as I have right there a timer to time them yes guys but on my electric big fryer it show me on the top there that it, when they are finished guys and I'm just gonna keep it easy now just leave them for 10 minutes guys and I'll get right back to you now here you have it guys up for that 10 minutes Deep frying. Look at that, guys. We're looking golden brown. I'm just gonna leave this here to let that oil drain off. Yes, guys. In the meanwhile, the oil is drain off, guys. You're gonna get you're gonna need a set of baking tray. Also, with your cooling rock. Yes, guys. A rock like this. We call it a cooling rock. Yes, guys. That's where you're gonna place your chicken on to let some breeze get underneath it, so it don't get all saggy. If you got a plate and you put them out in a plate guys, it's gonna get saggy but you need a cooling rack like this You can just put them out on it and let some breeze get underneath it guys I'm gonna remove these now I'm gonna just finish draining Just guys look at that I'm gonna place them out like that guys some more in. in the meanwhile that was frying guys I'll add some into my flour and I'm just going to add them into my tray now shake off the excess flour as I said it before Again, and those golden brown chicken wings. Yes, guys. Smelling so amazing, guys. I'm telling you, I couldn't resist and having two of them a while ago, guys. Tasting so lovely. I'm just gonna let that oil drain off. I'm just gonna remove them. Okay. Wow. Looking so delicious, so amazing. of my wings and I'm putting in before I start to make that delicious honey garlic sauce on the stove yes guys after these wings I'm just gonna make that lovely sauce and make you guys see Looking all golden brown. It's smelling so lovely. 
and I'll get right back to you guys when I'm going to make my sauce on the stove. I'm just going to remove my deep fryer from out the stove and then get right back to you guys when I'm making that lovely honey garlic sauce. I'm to make that delicious honey garlic sauce put on those lovely wings. Yes guys, you want to get your skillet or as we call it your frying pot. Guys, you want to go ahead and preheat it on medium low heat for about a minute. We have about three tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. Yes, guys. There you have it. I'll get right back to you guys when my pot is preheated. Now my oil and my pot is preheated. Yes, guys. Now you're gonna go in with your chopped garlic. Like that, guys. Guys, you want to saute your garlic, but you don't want to burn them and make them get black. Yes. Remember, garlic give off a bitter taste. You don't want that sauce to taste bitter. You just want to slightly saute them. That's right. And you want to stir them around, guys, so they don't burn. Now I'm going in with a cup of honey. But guys, I'm going to teach you a little trick. You can just use some light sunflower oil, spray oil or cooking oil. Just spray it into your cup so your honey will not stick inside of it. It will not stay, it does run out when you're chewing it out. Just guys, one cup of honey. around your garlic into your honey now guys you're gonna leave this to come to a, a boil but in the meanwhile it's coming to a boil you wanna keep stirring it around guys so you don't want your honey to stick to the bottom of your pot I'll get right back to you guys and show you when it's come, coming to a boil but in the meanwhile just keep stirring it around guys and there you have it guys this is what I'm talking about you can see Start to boil up most of this guys you can see get this come to this boiling now you're gonna go ahead and put in your soy sauce into it this guys you just gonna keep stirring that around now Soy sauce. It's coming. It's come to a boil now. This guy is just want your sauce to get thick. It's kind of watery at the moment. So now you're just gonna keep stirring it around until that sauce kind of get a little bit thick before you start to add your chicken wings into them. This guy into it. This guy. Keep stirring it guys, you don't want that to come over on the stove, just keep stirring it around. This is going to I'll turn off the stove, my sauce is picking up now guys, I'm just going to add my wings in, just mix those around. Sauce. Set that, guys. Lovely honey garlic sauce. I'm telling you guys, it's tasting so amazing. It just tasted a while ago. It's tasting so lovely, guys. So mix them around, guys. I'll get right back to you, guys, when I'm finished mixing all of these. Wings. 
wings into my sauce. Now look at that guys. Wow, I'm telling you. That's what I'm talking about guys. When I mix up all my wings into that lovely honey garlic sauce guys. That soy sauce. Wow, I'm telling you. Sauce. Perfect guys. This is so delicious. I can't wait to have this. Guys, I'm finished glazing all my wings into my sauce. So you want to prepare that lovely honey garlic wings. This guy, guys, I'm telling you guys, it's, it's amazing. It's tasting so lovely. I just have one of these wings in the sauce. Let's taste it and I'm telling you. Now this is finished now guys. I'm just gonna serve this out. Now here we have it guys. I've served out my honey glazed chicken wings with some celery, some broccoli. A serving of rice, some cucumber, some asparagus, and also some string bean. Yes, guys. Thanks for watching my home kitchen. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend. Hope you guys give this one a try at home and tell me what you think about it. Hit me up in the comment section and let me know, guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.